Hi, so we want to grab some data here from this site here that is um, a site from uh, Sole 24 Ore and has this data here that I'm going to grab the coronavirus data about uh, how many people are um, found uh, positive to uh, confirm that have uh, the coronavirus and let's see how to do it and so we need to do some stuff here and we need to import um, from BS4 import beautiful soap and then we need to import requests so we're gonna take the URL here and from this site we're gonna grab it from the address bar here this is the address then we are going to um, get the response from the site with the uh, request dot get and pass the URL inside inside of it and so let's print response and if the response is equal to 200 it um, it will be good there we go it's good now we're gonna take uh, parse our um, our response dot text so the page of the site um, with HTML dot parser and then uh, yeah okay um, now we want to to get our data here and if we go right click and go in inspect we can use this button here click on the number and see that this number is here into the h2 um, tag so we need the h2 tags from soap uh, dot find all h2 so if we print now h2 we should have all the h2 in the page and you can see here that the first one the first one contains the number that we need and is into apostrophes because it's a string so one thing that we can do is to uh, transform this the first string h2 0 let's put str to transform it into a string and then h2 we want to so if we print it let's see what we got we got just a string here and as it is into apostrophes our number we want to split the string by the apostrophes and then print h2 so h2 equal h2 splitted let's print it to see what we got we got now each data a lot of data here one two three four five six the six data that is the in this array in this list the number five element because it starts from from zero it will be the number that we want here so we're done we we are made what we want and we can also put uh, this one this code inside our web page um, using uh, for example the data camp uh, shell uh, interactive shell that can make us uh, put our number into our, this number into a web page and um, if you want to see how to do it you go into my python programming .org, one of the last um, you can check out in uh, and 
many sites and in, in this one for example you will find that here it is you can you can run it into your web page and it gives me an error here because okay now it works and so you want to see how I did it this is my blog and this is WordPress and you see I use script and style you get install this plugin and then use a shortcode to put the code inside of it and uh, you see that that was the, mm, the result here is is this one I think you see that I put into shortcodes the the code to use data cam shell and here we needed this sign so let me update it and um, now I want to show you the code so you save it as an HTML here you see that you get to put the, this code that we just did and uh, you can run it into a browser as you can see if you just put your code into this wrapper here You see this HTML code here, so simple. You use it, you put your Python code inside of here into this code data type sample code after this line here, and, uh, and you're good to go. You're gonna copy this, go into your Word WordPress site, um, create go here and after you install a script and style go in shortcodes go here paste it here give it a name add new there it is copy this one and copy and paste it into your page like I did here and so you can have your page with the with interactive shell code with Python inside this here like this one and now see that I corrected okay let me guess what is this let's get the result I haven't updated it probably I needed because I got more than one here no I got them let me update it and see if now it works now I can see the okay now it seems to work this is another code in the same page and it kinda worked this one too so that's all and see you next time